Good morning. Thank you for joining us here today at Willow Creek Homestead. We have gotten our morning chores done for the most part. Sam's got to check on his bunnies. And uh, today we are going to face a fear that has left me frozen. That's one of our favorite lines from a song that we enjoy off Pete's Dragon. The garden. Um, I in the past have grown tomatoes, peppers, you know, your regular garden stuff. Um, but with my autoimmune issue, I can't eat any of those things that I know how to grow. So, um, it's, I feel like it's kind of late in the game, late in the season. Um, but here in Idaho, um, there's a short growing season. Um, so I guess when I say late in the game, there's certain things that I don't know if I should have started inside before trying outside. So um, I'm going to call in reinforcements, which is my mom. So I'm going to give her a call today and ask her opinion on a few things. We did buy from a local seed store um, some starts on some squashes and some watermelon and stuff. So I'm going to get those in the ground and then I'm going to contact my mom and see if the seeds that I have in the house are something I can sow directly into the ground or if it's something that I have to start indoors. So I guess we'll wait for next year. We would really like to improve our garden plot. We would like to get to go to the um, back to Eden garden method. Um, we did till this year. Um, we need to get some mulch and some um, different things going in the garden. So we're gonna start, um, but for this year, I'm gonna face that fear that's left me frozen and I'm just gonna get a few things in the ground and if they die, at least I tried. Who's, where's the... So we're gonna plant the watermelon over here. This is Missy's. Last year we planted her a watermelon from seed and it grew really well. Um, and then the earwigs. And the chickens. The earwigs off. started eating it and then um, the chickens finished it off. Because Missy Mom, forgot to close I them want, up that day. I want that So sad, to be sad mine. times. You want that to be yours? Okay, Sarah's is the butternut squash. So that's good to know. So Missy is going to be in charge of taking care of these Watermelons. They're crimson sweets. We've not had good luck in growing watermelon, even as a kid. We just, I don't know, we've never had the greatest luck. So we're excited to try. We are going to put it up front by our willow and by um, our herb garden that is overgrown with grasses. <laughs> Let's get it in the ground. Missy. Okay. Squeeze the bottom. Squeeze it all around. Flip it upside down. Yep, good job. Get it in. Those are big roots. And then I do mine. In a minute, we gotta find the place for it. Yeah. That's cement. Right there. Ah. There we go. And then we gotta water them in really well. What kind of squash is it, Sarah? Butter squash. Butter squash? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, let's put Sarah's squashes right here. Mm-hmm. Okay, here. Let's put it in the ground. Can I go on? You're not helpful. You can You're gonna help me? Come help me. Stick this in the ground when you're Come done. Help me put your squashes in. Good job. Now put the dirt in. Like this. You helping? Good job. Awesome. Okay, you're in charge of this. You have to water it, honey. I'll help you. Every day. Good job. Good job, Sarah. Squeeze the bottom. Stop. There's a worm in there. Hey, come on, leave it there. There's a worm in there. That's a worm. What Banana are you going to plant? Spaghetti mm -hmm. squash. squash. And this squash. Acorn squash too. Hey, push it. I, I planted the the scary squash and I 
for the spaghetti squash. So I wanted to plant the acorn squash. Sammy. Awesome. We will get those watered in for the day. And I think I'll get to the seeds maybe a little later tonight or tomorrow. We've got a lot to get done today. So thanks for joining us today on this crazy adventure we call homesteading. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Hopefully we'll see you tomorrow.